Well, we got Antoine Bethea from the San Francisco 49er. What's up, man? Like, it's in your town now. Super Bowl's in your yeah, town. Yeah, man. I'm chilling, man. You know, just enjoying it, man. Hopefully, uh, y'all can enjoy the city like I normally enjoy it. Yeah. Now, are you excited about Chip Kelly and what he's going to bring to this uh, 49ers uh, experience? Yeah, man. You know, I'm excited. You know, um, you know, just, you know, being a fan and being on the outside looking in. Of course, you know, you hear different things, whether it's good or bad. But I'm definitely excited to, uh, to get this, uh, this new regime underway. Yeah, you know, I, I want to ask you about this because I, I don't know how many people know this about you. Uh, obviously, you, you know, a high-profile guy, but Howard University, man, that wasn't an easy path to the NFL. Right. Uh, how has that influenced you in your or motivate you in your career so far? I think that was 100%. Um, I'm a, I'm, well, a big motivation for me. It was just the whole, um, the whole process of it and just how many people said I couldn't do it coming from a small school. So I think that was the biggest thing for me. And then, um, you know, Going into my 11th year, man, just looking back on it, man, I'm just happy and just, you know, um, you know. Did just, you think that you were gonna be make it this far, 11 years in the in man, the league? Man, honestly, when I when I got that um that opportunity, it was all about making the team. Yeah. You know, whatever I can do to help the team, and like you said, like I, I can't sit here and say that I did, but it's it's definitely a blessing. I'm definitely grateful um to be able to say I played a decade in the league. Yeah, decade in the league. So I mean, clearly you've had a lot. Um, you know, to offer. You've influenced people uh, in the game, but also you have a foundation as well. Right. And so you're influenced. Tell us about your foundation. Yeah, I started my foundation in 2010 called the Safe Coverage Foundation. And uh, um, my whole um, focal point on that was just, you know, um, trust the community that, that, that helped me get to where I was at, you know, um, to help those kids continue education um, after high school, go to college, help them with their resources, um, you know, and, and that was the main focus, man. Just help these kids, man, you know, get out their comfort zone, out of our neighborhood, and just see that it's, 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 it's much more further out there beyond than just Newport News, Virginia. Well, that's, I mean, that's a noble thing. And, you know, people always want to know, I mean, outside of just the foundation, too, just getting to know you. I was reading on a Twitter I saw a while back, you know, you were interacting with the fans. So interacting with the community is big to you. Yeah. Also read that you uh, you love lasagna. That's your yeah, pregame that's, meal. that's my thing, You've man. You've had lasagna before every game for the last 11 years? I'm not going to say last 11 years, but for sure when mom when mom dupes come into town, if, if it's a home game, for sure I'm going to get that lasagna, man. It's just something that's been with me, man. And, you know, sometimes it could be a little superstitious, you know, whatever. But, you know, I had a, had a great game one day. And I'm like, hey, man, I'm just, just keeping the same. Is there a lasagna or a restaurant that serves, lasa like, the best lasagna ever? Is there one that's, like, at the top of your list? I can't really say that right now. Yeah. I'll, I'll stick with Mom's lasagna right now. Hey, it don't get better than Mom's lasagna. <laughs> that's Antoine Patel. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Yeah.